Well, this photo here on social media is getting a lot of attention. It shows Boy Scouts holding campaign signs for San Diego mayoral candidate Kevin Faulkner. Critics point out the Scouts are supposed to be nonpartisan. Attendance reporter Maria, Maria Arcega Dunn spoke with both the Scoutmaster and the Faulkner campaign. It's a posting on San Diego mayoral candidate Kevin Faulkner's Twitter and Facebook that's created some controversy. This photo of local Boy Scout Troop 246 at Kevin Faulkner's campaign headquarters holding campaign signs. The Boy Scouts of America is considered a nonpartisan organization. Critics say they have no business holding up signs promoting Faulkner's campaign. Fair play doesn't allow for nonpartisan groups like that to be politicized. 10 News spoke to Scoutmaster Mike Sisk of Boy Scout Troop 246 on the phone. Sisk would wouldn't appear on camera, but he says being at the Faulkner headquarters was simply part of a merit badge qualification to learn about politics and in no way was intended to promote any one candidate. We tracked down the Boy Scouts of America's rules and regulations, which reads photos of candidates or scouts in uniform or BSA marks and logos are not allowed in political campaigns or materials of any kind. During a Faulkner event, 10 News was unable to get the candidate to comment on the Boy Scout photo. However, his campaign spokesman says it was merely a lesson in local government. It was an educational um, forum for, for these young men to get a better understanding of, of, of what a, what, what's involved in a campaign. Faulkner rival and mayoral candidate Mike Aguirre says it's simply last minute election politics. I don't think it was done evil with any evil intent, but I do think a lot of times ethical choices are embedded in our decisions in a way that they're hard to, to recognize. And, you know, upon reflection, I think uh, Kevin probably should step forward and, you know, take responsibility. Maria Arcega Dunn, 10 News. And our final mayoral poll before next Tuesday's election comes out Sunday. We're going to have the results in our weekend morning show. You can also get those results at right to your smartphone or tablet via our, via our 10 News app. To get it, just go to the App Store and search for 10 News.